Hey there, everyone. It's Denise Salcedo, and standing with me right now is Zoe Stark. Zoe, I, you know what? I got to tell you, each and every single week that I see you on NXT every Tuesday, I'm like, this girl goes out there, and she just freaking works, man. Your in-ring your in -ring work, it, it, it's incredible. Zoe, I, I just want to make sure that you know that before we start I this that. interview. I, I really appreciate that because I, I put a lot of pride into my work and I want to make sure that I'm telling a story every single time I'm in there. You know, it's not always just about the athletics. We could all, we're all athletes in there, you know, let's tell a story. So let's talk about that because your time in NXT has been very interesting. You know, you came in there, you were doing your thing, you were kind of away for a bit, but then you came back yeah. and then you're getting the ball rolling once again. Talk to me a little bit about some of the changes that we've been seeing in NXT. You know, we have Shawn Michaels taking yeah. over, we got this new era. Um, what's the journey been like for you? Uh, three different eras. Black and gold, right? NXT 2.0. Yep. Now we're kind of mixing both of them, right? It's a crazy time right now. Like, it's so fun, and to be able to work with Shawn Michaels and Matt Bloom, and it's a great time. Talk yeah. to us about what sort of advice uh, Shawn Michaels has provided you and also some of the women, because we do get a lot of women's matches on yeah, NXT, which sure. is incredible yeah. to see. He highlights us women very, very well, and he, uh, we were talking more about character stuff. How do we evolve with all of that? So he's given me some advice on that and how he kind of found himself as well. So I'm trying to implement some of that, you know, different characters from TV shows or movies or singers and things like that. Like I'm a big fan of Pink, oh, yeah. right? Like she just came out with a great new album. So big fan of Pink, try to implement that. Sarah Connor from Terminator. Uh, so I try to implement some of these characters into the mix as well. Okay, well now that you mentioned it, I have to ask you, what's your favorite Pink song ever? You know, <clears throat> Trust Fall's great, but uh, I'm kind of, like when she first started coming out in 2003, like I was listening to that first yes. album. What an, what an album. <laughs> Her, I think it's misunderstood. Yes, that's the one that I love. Yeah. I love conversations with my 13 year old Sal. She's got deep stuff and fun stuff. Yeah, she does. Like, she's she hits every single point, so she's great. She's a badass. So, cool. so, Zoe, one of the things about you is we do have a lot of you know, a newer talent on NXT that's really you know, starting to get their you know, they're starting to get their sea legs. Yeah. But when they go in there with you, I feel like whenever they have a match with you, we start to see this like you bring out the very best in a lot of people. Thank and you. I do want to ask you your thought process when you're in there with someone that is a newer talent. What yeah. is your thought process on that? I just gotta make, I wanna make sure they look good. You know, let's get them off to a great start. Like uh, Sol Ruka, right? Like what a, what a phenomenal athlete. She does some great things, you know? So my goal in that was like, all right, let's have the best match that we could possibly have. And she delivered. She did a great job just kinda letting, letting me kinda take charge a little bit and just following and she's awesome to work with. And she's so cool. I think she, there's so many people, there's so many women on NXT that yeah. I'm like, oh my God, I can't wait to see what she's going to be doing in a couple yes. of years, what she's going to be doing she, in a couple of years. It's I, inspiring. It's very inspiring. I, I think she has a big career. I do. I think she's going to do very, very well here. So, Zoe, I do want to ask you because we have obviously the big matchup we got to talk about is that ladder match, and you're part of it. There's a good chance that you can come out NXT Women's Champion. Talk to us about how you feel going into this big matchup at Crypto.com, and, and it's a ladder match too. Like, that just adds to it. Yeah. <laughs> uh, not a good chance. I will be taking that NXT Women's Championship. Mm -hmm. Sorry, Roxanne, but that title is coming to me now. But for me, it's a full circle moment. So I grew up in California, and uh, crypto, yeah, once upon a yeah. time, was called Staples Center. Yep. I would go there all the time, and I would watch Raw, and I would watch them live. And that's when, like, the first time I walked through that arena, I saw, like, the ring just sitting right there. I was like, oh, this is my life right here. Like, this is all I've ever wanted to do. Got goosebumps. And I, was, and I just look, I remember looking up to my mom. I was like, this is what I'm going to do, Mom. And then she supported me the whole way. So it's really really exciting to be able to perform in front of the same you know the same yeah. arena like it's so fun you're gonna be seeing those lakers banners from a different angle, angle. this time you're gonna yeah. be staring up at yeah. them instead of oh hey <laughs> hi yeah, yeah, I'm, ex I'm so excited for That's it. That's so cool. And my last question for you is, uh, you know, your goals, you know, uh, what, what do you want to still accomplish in NXT? How, how anxious are you to go to Raw, to SmackDown? Tell us about that. You know what? Yes. I'm super anxious to get to Raw and SmackDown, of course. But I'm just focused on Saturday. I, I want to get that NXT Women's Championship before I head up to main roster. I want to add that list or add that onto my list of accolades. 
Awesome, awesome. Yeah. Well, Zoe, thank you so much for taking the time to talk with me. And enjoy this weekend because it is going to be incredible. Live the dream, girl. Thank you thank so much, you Zoe. So much. Thank Appreciate you. Your time. Awesome.